Hi, welcome back to the Shabbat Show again. Continue reading from the Safe and the Shepherd's Arm. Part 5. He restores my soul. Jesus restores our hope by giving us himself. It is hard to see things grow old. The town in which I grew up is growing old. Some of the buildings are boarded up and some of the houses are torn down. The old movie house where I took my date has a Versailles for sale sign on the marquee. I wish I could make it all new again. I wish I can blow the dust off the streets, but I can't. I can't, but God can. He restores my soul, wrote the shepherd. He doesn't reform, he restores. He doesn't camouflage the old, he restores the new. The master builder will pull out the original plan and restore it. He will restore the vigor. He will restore the energy. He will restore the hope. He will restore the soul, the applause of heaven. For many people, life is, well, life is a jungle. Not a jungle of trees or beasts, where that it was so simple. Would that our jungle will be cut with a machete or our adversaries trapped in a cage. But our jungles are comprised of trickered, thickered, of failing health, broken hearts, and empty wallets. Our forests are framed with hospital walls and divorce courts. We don't hear the screeching of the birds or a roaring of the lions, but we do hear the complaints of neighbors and demands of bosses. Our predators are our creditors, and the brush that surrounds us is the rush that exhausts us. It is a jungle out there. And for some, even for many, hope is in short supply. What would it take to restore your hope? Our shepherd major in restoring hope to the soul. Whether you are a lamb lost on a cruddy ledge, or a city slicker along in the deep jungle. Everything changes when your rescuer appears. Your loneliness diminishes because you have fellowship. Your despair decreases because you have vision. Your confusion begins to lift because you have direction. Please note, you haven't left the jungle. The trees still eclipse the skies and the thorns still cut the skin. Animal lurks and rope and scurry. The jungle is still a jungle. It hasn't changed, but you have. You have changed because you have hope. And you have hope because you have met someone who can lead you out. Your shepherd knows that you are not made for this place. He knows you are not equipped for this place. So he has come to guide you out. He has come to restore your soul. Jesus doesn't give hope by changing the jungle. He restores our hope by giving us himself. And he has promised to stay until the very end. I am with you always to the very end of age. Never will I leave you. Never will I forsake you. Matthew chapter 28 verse 20. This is your ride. Continue to chapter. Thank you.